in this example, this one gets a lot of students. They don't like this fraction here. So Sam, what we do is we rewrite it as 1 half times x. And you'd agree with me, 1 half times x is the same thing as x divided by 2, correct? Yes? That usually makes things a little bit easier for people. So therefore, we can say that, oh, we have a vertical stretch of 3, right? And we also have a horizontal stretch of um, horizontal compression. No, it's, uh, yeah, it's going to be a compression of, no, it's getting, um, it's, you're going to have a horizontal stretch. It's not a compression, it's a horrid, you're going to have a horizontal stretch as well. And of one half, it's kind of get confusing, but again, let's look at the period. What is the period of cosecant? What's the period of cosecant? 2 pi over b. What's b in this case? Over 1 half. Multiply by the reciprocal, you now have a new period of 4 pi. So instead of it taking 2 pi for it to create a period, it now takes 4 pi. So it's being horizontally stretched. Remember, those are kind of like op they're reciprocal, they're opposites of each other, uh -huh. if they're in there. So, but all you really, all I need you to do is just kind of tell me if there's reflections, kind of what we practice today. You're just saying ref 